Hi, I'm Josh Ellsworth with Stalls TV. In this CAD Works tutorial, I want to teach you how to create a piece of text with clip art uh, dropped within as a design element of the text, like you see on the screen here with the black hawks with the hawk head um, as the A in black. Um, so I'm going to delete this off the screen and show you how you can create this sort of look within CAD Works. And I'll start by adding some basic text, which is one of the fund fundamentals of CAD Works by clicking the Add Text button. Let's do something like Eagles, select my preferred font. Once I have the basic text I'd like and the font and the sizing I'd like, click OK. And it will drop it onto the design screen. At this point, this text is reading as a single image. If I would like to uh, break it apart and work with the uh, characters individually. All I need to do is select it and go up to my shaping and break it apart by regions. Uh, regions is uh, the level of detail I want to break this apart to. If I go all the way down to curves, it's actually going to separate the center of the A from the outside of the A. Uh, and I only want individual characters, so I'll break apart by regions. And that will allow me to select each individual uh, character uh, to delete, substitute, size, whatever I'd like to do. At this point, I need to bring in my eagle clip art to drop within the design of the text. I'll click on Add Clip Art. I can search for the keyword eagle, grab a design I like. It will drop it within the design screen. At this point, I can decide what character I'd like to replace with this. In this case, I'm going to replace the G, so I'll simply delete the G by selecting it and pressing delete on my keyboard and then I'll drag the eagle into the placement I'd like it size it by grabbing the corner handle of the design and clicking and dragging to get it to be the preferred size that I want at this point there's one last little detail I need to do which is called a weld command if I go into my wireframe view by clicking the bottom right of my screen in CADWorks, I will see what the actual vinyl cutter reads. And if I send this to my heat transfer film, you can see the eagle wing is going to cut into the L, and ultimately it's going to finish the. Uh, it's going to impact the finish application. Why heat apply this to a garment? You're going to see that these are cut through one another. It's not going to be the best quality. Um, so all I need to do is um, click and drag a box around both design elements and go up to my shaping menu and click on weld to join those pieces together. At that point it makes a one clean cut image. I can go back out of the wireframe view. I can select all of my design and group it together using the condense uh, command under the shaping menu. Now everything selects together again and I can size it uh, to the proper size for my garment. This has been a CADWorks Live tutorial by Stalls TV. Thanks for watching.